Hello there lovelies, my name is Monaco97 and today I like to call this series Anime News Source whenever I talk about everything and anything new upcoming for anime and anime based video games and today I'm going to be talking about Asui, Denki, and Momo being playable characters in My Hero Academia's One's Justice. In the newest issue of Weekly Shonen Jump, scans have shown that Asui, Momo, and Denki are playable characters in My Hero Academia's One's Justice in Weekly Shonen Jump magazine. But before I show you the rest of these screenshots, I would like to know what character would you like to be playable in My Hero Academia's One's Justice? For me, my dream team would be Toga, Don Nami, Namina, Namori, and Kami. So that's my list of characters, and I'm curious to see your list of playable characters in the comment section below. But if they have to replace Togo with Kami, I would perfectly be fine with that, even though they're the same person. But My Hero Academia's Once Justice is coming out to the Nintendo Switch, PS4, PC, and Xbox in 2018. But moving on, One Piece World Seekers takes place on a jail island. In addition to One Piece World Seekers location, Tashiki, Smoker, Rob Bellucci, and Sabo are also brand new characters that will be featured on this brand new adventure. While their purpose in the main story hasn't been announced yet, there are multiple stealth features that are featured in this game, such as Luffy hiding inside barrels and Luffy locating enemies from far distances. There are also physical attacks, such as Luffy going gear third and Luffy using his fire ability, but I'll let the screenshot speak for itself. But One Piece World Seekers is set to release in 2018. But moving on, Fuka and Futaba playable in Persona 3 Dancing Moonlight and Persona 5 Dancing Star Knight alongside a brand new trailer showcasing everything that both versions have to offer. But speaking of both versions, it's funny how Fuka and Futaba have similar names and they both start with the letter F. I guess that's kind of why they both released at the same time. And I love the animation intros for both Fuka and Futaba, but if I had to pick a character I'm most looking forward to, it's definitely Futaba without a doubt from her dancing to her outfits and her overall personality as a whole. And before we get to the newest trailer, both versions of Persona 3 and Persona 5 comes with music videos and live performances from Japan. Alongside anime AMV cutscenes that correlate with the rhythm gameplay, multiple areas and rooms for first person mode, and custom outfits for each individual character for both versions. But how about I let the trailer speak for itself? But Persona 3 Dancing Moonlight and Persona 5 Dancing Star Knight releases on May 24th in Japan. <laughs> あ、知らないで。これは場所はどこですか？ウルフラン。なんかちっちゃくなってますよね。あ、テーブルの上で束が。裏だ。裏だ。<笑> 
じゃあ手間っては取れないっていう<笑>そういうことですかいやーお口が設定なのまたその動きが盛り上がこれこれでも正直ちょっと双葉の場合こうダンスと言えるのかっていう結構ありますけどやっぱりキャラクターに合わせてその中にすごいあのこだわりありますから思い入れありそうですね、はい、ダンサーへのオーダーってどんな感じでしょうか双葉は結構難しかったなと思うんですけどね、はい、なんかまあキャラクターに合わせてちょっとコメカルな動きもありつつ、はい、ライブであのタップダンスとか機能、はいはい、してたと思うんですけどあ,あのザッキーですねはい、はい、入ってるとかいやもうなんか上手い人があこういう動きとかいやすごいなコンテンツはナビなんでこう活発に動く印象がないキャラクターね。元気だけどそうですね。どちらかというとこう文化系ですもんね。もっとさらけ出せ。お前それ。元気でいて元気でいてやっぱ風化がね。風化ちゃんとしてあのポジションで。フィーバー。お、東京新大。来た。お。似合いますね。うん、ね、によってね。普段からこんな格好してんちゃうっていうような。僕、うん、あの新スリーつけてた時に、このモデルを作ったんですよ。あ、そうなんですか。ええーはい、ちょっと考えみたいですね。よく動けてみたい。割とまんま持ってきて。ええー、スラウドではない。お前ら息合いすぎじゃない。あ、なんか動きにストーリーがあった。おおもすごい気づいたら122すごいよさすが若さんマジシャン DJ いいわあ斧いいですねいいんじゃないいいまた来たいやフィーブいやーこれすごいですねちょっと手をどうかなと思って。わお後ろからは見られます、ね。おお。いやー、すごいすごい。俺より全然いってる。ブリリアント。ブリリアント。楽しい。大丈夫。チンパって言うんだ。いいやつ。いいやつ。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。これでいいな。ね、いいんじゃないですか。分かってよ。それは合ってる。合ってて腐ってる。絶対あざといよ。ほら、あーあー、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、見て、かっこいい<笑>
And the last topic of today, Bardock and Broly announces playable characters in Dragon Ball Fighters and to top it all off, a brand new Dragon Ball mobile game titled Dragon Ball Legacy is releasing in summer of 2018, but that's it for this video. Again, if you're new to my channel, I talk about everything and anything upcoming for anime and anime based video games. And overall, I would like to see your comments or your thoughts about this in the comment section below. But again, I'll let the trailers and the video speak for itself, but thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.